Okay, there's there's been a lot of questions about um, my listing here uh, for this Glock Airsoft uh, blowback pistol by KSC, um, and the question is about this part here. Um, it's the safety switch, and as you can see, there's three settings. Uh, up is for single shot, and down is for fully automatic and the middle is safe and the problem uh, I've said that there's some missing parts and those parts are uh, from let's see if you can see that it's a bit dark just um, on the other side just there there's a black hole and there's a pin that goes in there um, and that pin connects to uh, the safety switch. If I pull the safety switch out, normally I wouldn't be able to do this because that pin holds it in place. Uh, I don't know if you probably can't see because it's black, but there's a little groove there, and the pin um, goes into that groove so it stops it being able to be pulled out. And if we look inside where the safety mechanism is, that's blue tack around the uh, where I've stuck blue tack to keep the switch where I want it. Um, the white stuff. Uh, inside you can see three little holes, and that's where the BB sits, and it locks it into position um, on auto, single shot, or safe. <coughs> so it's the BB. I think the spring holding the BB. Uh, by the, if you look at the diagrams, looks like that's missing as well. Um, and obviously the safety search will go back in fine. And I'll just demonstrate it firing it empty. So that's single shot. And okay, so it, I can fire it once, but as you can see, it's gone back to safe. It won't stay on single shot. Same as if I put it down to fully automatic, it'll fire once, and it's gone back to safe. Um, so obviously the, the solution that I came up with, I mean, when I bought this, I bought it brand new, um, and I was fiddling around with it, I was a bit new to Airsoft, and I think I was like taking it apart, and I, I just I misplaced the pin and the spring and BB I think popped out and I, I I don't know why I didn't look for them or find them but yeah um, so since then I've just been using blue tack so if I want to fire a single shot I put it up to there stick a bit of blue tack to hold it into place and it was working fine and I've used it um, every time I've used it it's been fine doing that I've used it um, a fair amount and uh, it's been Absolutely perfect, and same for multiple shot. I'll see if I can find some blue tack and I'll demonstrate it firing. Okay, so here it is with a little bit of blue tack, um, putting it up to the single shot position, and I'll just demonstrate it firing. Uh, it's empty, so I'm just holding the catch that stops it when it's empty. Fires fine. Okay, and then I'll just move that down to auto. Yeah, and demonstrate it firing. Okay, and you can see it's pretty awesome when it's firing automatic, if you haven't seen one firing before. But yeah, I mean, that's the simple fix I've been using, and it's been working great. Um, I know it's a bit ghetto, but um, it looks like I was, I mean, I found that Cobra site. I know it's American, but I don't know if you can order. I, I went through the checkout process, and it looks like they ship to other countries. So you might be able to get the parts in a few dollars. Uh, but otherwise, you could just get a, um, a good price on a great little gun uh, with... Um, a small problem um, 
yeah, so hopefully that uh, helps everybody with questions, um, helps them understand what the problem is, and can see the gun working. And yeah, it's a great little gun.